Well, Alex, thank you. Here's some stories to keep your radar as we kick off a brand new week, starting with state lawmakers heading back to Augusta today for another day of the legislative session. There are still some unresolved bills, including one that would grant sovereignty to the state's native tribes. Assuming lawmakers do finish their work today, they would be expected to return to deal with any potential vetoes. The governor does have 10 days from the time a bill is passed to issue any potential veto. In Portland, the city manager is expecting to present her proposed budget later tonight. Interim manager Danielle West was supposed to present that budget two weeks ago, but she delayed it, saying she would have a better idea of how the state budget would affect the city budget. The proposal is expected to go to the Finance Committee for review on Thursday. Then that committee will hold a public hearing later on. On Tuesday, leaders in Bangor would like to get your thoughts about the city's plans for the future. The planning division is holding lessening sessions about the comprehensive plan. It's used as a roadmap for Bangor's future. City leaders are holding three different sessions, two Tuesday, one Wednesday. The first one will be at the Boys and Girls Club tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock. And finally, on Sunday, new gear regulations are supposed to go in place for Maine lobstermen. While these rules will officially take effect then, state officials say they are still working on a plan to enforce them gradually. State leaders had previously asked NOAA to maybe push back the deadline until July 1st to give lobstermen more time to get the gear that they would need. For more on any of these stories or more, you can always go to our website, newcentermain.com, or check out our mobile app.